What's good, y'all? It's your boy Trail Guy Game back with another video showing y'all how to do the spin glitchy donkey dunk thousand. You heard? You feel me? It's a real crazy spin dunk. I showed you how to do it on NBA 2K20, but now I'm showing you how to do it on NBA 2K21, man. I showed you how effective it is, and it's still effective to this day, especially if you have a slasher. If you have a slasher, you can keep doing this move over and over. You're going to get a layup animation sometimes, but listen, most of the time, you're not going to get the layup animation. You're just going to dunk on the opponent, or you're just going to get a, a dunk. So, you know what I'm saying? So make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Like like the video, y'all. Like the video right now. Like that shit right now, y'all. Sub, all that, you feel me? So um, let's get right into it, y'all. So as you can see, I have the hand cam on the screen, man. You know I gotta get y'all with the in-depth, with the in-depth, you feel me? So I'm gonna I'm gonna do it for y'all right now so y'all can see what I'm talking about. You feel me? You feel me that? It's real glitchy, y'all. I'm telling y'all. I'm going to do it again for y'all one more time. As y'all can see, I have the hand cam on the screen. You feel me? It's that simple, y'all. It's really that simple. But listen, y'all. I'm going to break it down, right? All right, let's start off right here. Let's start off right here. And I'm going to show you another way to do it, too. But let's start off for the simple way. You know what I'm saying? If you want to go right, make sure you go clockwise. You aim the controller down like this. You feel me? Look, look at the controller, the right stick. You aim it down and you flick it like that. It's just that simple. Well, that's all you have to do. But hold it though. Once you do it like that, exactly what I just did. So I'm gonna I'm gonna demonstrate it for y'all. So you run to the corner, right? You run to the corner, and then you do it. As you can see, I caught a layup animation because I let go of R2. If you want to just strictly do layups, you, you don't hold R2. But if you want to dunk, make sure you hold R2. So I'm going to do it again. Boom. It's that simple, y'all. It's literally that simple. Now, for the other side, you go counterclockwise. You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to do it right here. Hold R2. You feel me? Go crazy, y'all. I'm telling y'all, it's simple. It's nice and simple, y'all. It's not, you know what I'm saying? You don't got to be intelligent, you know what I'm saying? You don't got to practice it. You practice it, you feel me? But it's not nothing It's going to take you a long time to learn. And another way to do it, if you want to do it at the baseline, I said baseline, uh, at the free throw line, all right, basically, you run just like that, y'all, but I just messed it up. But you gotta run towards the free throw line, so like, let me see. just like that, y'all. It's it's real simple, y'all. You feel me? You just gotta know how to time it. You practice it. You know what I'm saying? Experiment with the the move, man. It's real cheesy. It's real glitchy. So make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, and I'm out. I'm gonna show y'all some more stuff. You feel me? On these upcoming days, man. I haven't been really grinding like I was supposed to be, but you feel me? I'm I'm putting out that content, so help me out, yeah. Help me out, help me out, help me out. Oh, you're gonna get it cracking, you heard? Alright. So grrr.